Are they still here? Can they not settle a trifling matter more quickly? I am told this Mr. Galloway moves mankind away from the centre of the universe and dumps it so on the edge. Well, clearly this makes him an enemy of the human race and we must treat him as such. How could he take something so marvellous, the fruit of so much effort, and lodge it on some remote and minor, constantly elusive star? Well, poor, poor Woody said he's trying to the race. And how can there be these people so perverse as to fend their faith on these, 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 these multiplication tables. Well, That's him over there. Oh, who's you is it? Uh, my eyesight may not be what it was, but I can see one thing clearly. You bear a remarkable likeness to that, uh, that man. What was what, his name? The one we burned. <laughs> yes, you would debase the earth, even though you're living it and gain everything from it. I, for one, am not going to stand for it. I am not of some old creature of some insignificant star, certainly no particular place. I am walking with firm step on fixed earth. It is motionless. I am at the centre, and the eye of the Creator falls upon me, and me alone around about me, attached to the eight crystal spheres, and the revolving stars, and the mighty sun, created to light my surroundings, and me too, that God may see me. In this way, everything becomes visible, indivisible, depend on me, mankind, made in God's own image, and, and, and indestructible. Oh.